Hi guys, today we are out and about to make a public reaction towards bullying, school bullying to be exact. According to statistics, bully cases are not as frequent as it is today. However, there are many cases where the bully victims are being killed. So, why is it happening? I find it to be unfair. Let's see what the public thinks about it. Uh, yes, it happened before, during my school time. My school days, no, because back then, Discipline was very strict and uh, the teachers were more careful about their students. Not as a, not frequently, but uh, I, I wouldn't say I'm a victim of Yes, I, yes, I, I have. Um, I'm, I'm afraid not. I actually have never experienced any bullying. I guess so. How about yeah. you? I, yeah, I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, before I proceed to the next question, I would like to show you a video. Frankly, I'm appalled that's actually happening in our schools. Uncivilized. How do you feel? My my heart is in pain right now. My my whole body is shivering. It's it's very painful. I guess mostly. Mostly mad, I guess. Um, I don't think these things should happen in school. Angry? Sad. Sad. Yes, I feel very, very terrible because such uh, violence as, as expressed by those students bullying that one student is really too much. It shows that our social values, our moral values, all have really gone down. I feel most bullies bully because of peer pressure. I think that's one of the main reasons. Like they think it's cool or it's in trend or if you want to mix around and socialize and be in the cool kids. Uh, I would blame the parents for the bad upbringing of these kids who are bullying other kids. That's that's the I mean bad upbringing of kids because when the kids are mentally psychologically not okay, there's something wrong, they are not feeling happy, they're feeling angry for some reason. That anger, these emotions have to come out. If they can't come out at home, they will come out somewhere else. Most naturally will come out at school. Uh, okay, one is the lack of discipline in the school. Okay. And uh, uh, since, I, as, as far as I know, many teachers are overburdened with paperwork as a result of which often teachers are not in the present in the class and that is one of the causes of bullying because then the, the students uh, are left on their own and the, those who are more aggressive yes. take a, tend to take an upper hand. Uh, basically it's come from the uh, negative uh, films, negative movies you know. So you're trying to say that school children are being influenced by? Yeah indirectly yes because uh, you must know that now this uh, the multimedia, the social media, uh, TVs, you know, actually have a very big influence to the young generation. One is because of uh, lack of attention. Okay. Uh, another is because they are, they think that being violent, by being violent, they can uh, sort of express themselves, have a following. That could be another reason and also because nowadays they belong to a group and so they, they form a gang and they tend to catch those who are not in their group. Uh, 
actually we can see once it's occur everyone is impacted yes you know society families I feel about it yeah um, I mean I guess angry because um, it shouldn't be happening in our society yeah angry because you know it can be prevented uh, I think it's really silly first of all because the kids don't really understand the repercussions of their actions they don't understand that they can actually kill someone and take someone's life. One thing for sure, death is something. Uh, I mean, it's basically a a terrible case. You know, um, it shouldn't be uh, it shouldn't be happening uh, in uh, in towards bullying. I mean, bullying uh, that leads towards death is something you need to check on. I mean, it's a, I think it's a mental illness. solution is I think the school plays an important role in this because most of the time the students are being at school compared to the house uh, due to extra classes or what. I think the teachers must be more careful and they should niche their, the bullies going around and bullying other students not just like for one day or two days. I think this should be the punishment should be very serious education uh, awareness bringing in all the parents like this what this incident just showed me should not just be uh, forgotten it should be there should be created some awareness about this in all schools everywhere in the country okay all the parents should be notified that if something like if their kids are behaving like that they will get a fine I'll give them a big bad fine okay something that the kids will have to be punished somehow I don't care if they're kids, they have to be punished. I'm not saying they have to be beaten like they beat others, but they will have to be punished. They have to understand the consequences of their actions. I think it's all, yeah, it all boils down to education. I mean, um, in the end of the day, if you're being educated really well in school um, and the teachers really teach you and actually raises these kind of problems, uh, it would probably be avoided. Um, in the end of the day, it also boils down to it's at home, you know. Everything uh, starts at home. So parents need to take a role in this situation and teachers. So there you go, guys. If you guys have any opinions on bullying, please let us know in the comment section below. Like, share, and subscribe to our channel. The more you share our video, the more we'll be able to create an awareness. Hence, we might make a change. Hashtag, say something. Till then, signing off, Sandra.